Hello and welcome. In this video, let's talk about the Snapdragon 865 and 8888 Plus. Let's see what the best budget specifications are still good for Switch emulator gaming. Before I start, this video is credited to the owner, allowing me to make content like this. Also, thanks to the Emulator BR Group. Now let's start. Our first spot is the Snapdragon 865 with only 6 GB of RAM, using the Samsung Galaxy S20 FE. This four-year-old phone is quite interesting because this specification can handle almost a lot of emulators until now. As you can see, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild runs smoothly on the Snapdragon 865, using Sudachi emulator and adding some mods. You can see the game runs at stable 30 FPS without any experience problems. This game is pretty good and playable on the Snapdragon 865. Next is the Snapdragon 888 Plus with 8GB of RAM. Using Moto G200, this device was released in 2022. We all know that this specification is quite a bit pricey compared to the Snapdragon 865. It also runs at stable 30 FPS and playable, without any signs of issues. Here are the rankings of both chipsets. You can see a big gap between the rankings of the processors, but when it comes to performance, they are almost the same. That means the Snapdragon 865 still can handle the Switch emulator, but the Snapdragon evolved every year. So we need to choose wisely what phones or processors can handle all emulators for a year. And the Snapdragon 888 Plus is also a big deal if you want more performances. What I want to say is, if you have a tight budget to upgrade your potato phone, choose the SD865 for a cheap flagship phone. Or if you have a good budget, you can pick the Snapdragon 888 Plus or higher for emulator gaming. The question is, how long can both Snapdragon 865 and 888 Plus handle all emulators? The answer is, it depends on how long you are playing or abusing your phone. If your phone temperature goes higher, then you need to stop playing. Because even the latest Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 can't handle the heating issues of the Switch emulator. Like you, I'm always looking for a good news about the Android emulators. I'm hoping soon all the games of the Switch can be played, without any issues. Thanks to all developers, they never stop updating, risking their lives to make a better emulator gaming experience. I hope you like my video. Thanks for watching. See you on my next update.